गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स ऑफ एक्सरसाइज ट्वेल्व पॉइंट वन नाउ द्वेश्चन इज फाइंड रेशियो ऑफ दी फॉलोइंग स्टूडेंट्स हियर इन इज क्वेश्चन वी आर टू फाइंड आउट रेशियो ऑफ द गिवन क्वांटिटीज और नंबर्स नाउ फर्स्ट एटी वन टू वन जीरो एट हियर टू फाइंड आउट रेशियो ऑफ दीज टू नंबर्स देर फॉर वी कैन राइट हियर रेशियो Which is equal to. Now, students, we are going to write first number on numerator and second number on denominator. First of all, we are going to write these two numbers in numerator and denominator form. Therefore, if you observe here, this eighty one and one zero eight both are divisible by nine. Nine times of eighty one. Now, if we divide one zero eight by nine, then one zero eight divided by nine, nine one zero nine. Here one subtraction one. Now eight here nine two zero eighty. Subtraction zero zero. Therefore here quotient is twelve. Therefore students, if we divide numerator and denominator by nine, then nine by twelve. Now students, if you observe here. Again, nine and twelve both are divisible by three. Therefore, three three is a nine. Three four is a twelve. Therefore, which is equal to three by four. Therefore, students, here ratio is three is to four. Here numerator. We can write first and denominator. We can write second. Therefore, ratio of these two numbers is three is to four. Now, students, second, ninety-eight to sixty-three. Here we have to find out ratio of these two numbers. Therefore, students, we can write here ratio. First of all, we have to write these two numbers in fraction form. That is ninety-eight. By sixty-three. Now, students, first number on denominator, second number on denominator. If you observe here, both numbers are divisible by seven. Here, if you divide sixty-three by seven, then seven nine is a sixty-three. If you divide ninety-eight by seven, if you divide ninety-eight by seven, then seven one is a seven. Here, subtraction two. Here, eight. Seven four is a twenty-eight. Now here zero zero. Therefore, quotient is fourteen. Therefore here fourteen. Which is equal to fourteen by nine. Therefore, students, here this numerator we can write first. Now ratio symbol and denominator second. Therefore, students, ratio of these two numbers is. Fourteen is to nine. Now, next question: thirty-three kilometer to one hundred twenty-one kilometer. Students, here kilometer, here kilometer. Units are same. Therefore, we can find out ratio of these two quantities. Therefore, we can find out ratio. Here we have to write first quantity on numerator and second quantity on denominator. One twenty one. Now, students, thirty-three and one twenty-one both are divisible by eleven. Eleven is the thirty-three, and eleven into eleven, which is equal to one twenty-one. Therefore, one twenty-one divided by eleven is equal to eleven. Therefore, which is equal to three by eleven. Therefore, students, ratio is three is to eleven. Therefore, students, for this question, ratio is. Three is to eleven. Now next, thirty minutes to forty-five minutes. Minutes, minutes. Units are same. Therefore, we can find out here ratio. Therefore, ratio is equal to thirty by forty-five. Now, first quantity on numerator, second quantity on denominator. Therefore, thirty and forty-five both are divisible by fifteen. Fifteen two is a thirty, and fifteen three is a forty-five. 
this is equal to 2 by 3. Therefore, simplest form of this fractional number or numerator upon denominator form which is equal to 2 by 3. Therefore, ratio is 2 is to 3. Therefore, students, ratio of 30 minutes to 45 minutes is 2 is to 3. Students, in this way, we can find out ratio of the given two quantities. I hope it is clear to you. Thank you and have a nice day.